getting close to New Year's Eve. <laughs> yeah, actually, um, three more nights, 72 hours, something like that, Thursday night. And, you know, I'm, I'm getting used to wearing these. And I think I'm going to probably have a good time on New Year's Eve, if only because I need to get in some dancing. I definitely need a couple of beers. I've earned them this year. And, uh, well, I... <laughs> I guess uh, if they fall out while I'm dancing, uh, <laughs> but you know, I can't let the fact that these are not mine prevent me from going out and having a good time, basically. So, yeah, I'll make sure I have my glue, and uh, <laughs> I still got to decide what to wear, because <laughs> you know, New Year's Eve, you got to dress up a little bit, at least I do. <laughs> Actually, you know, I do have some quite <laughs> quite a bit of actually pretty dresses you can't see in here. But I think I'm going to go with pants for New Year's Eve just because it is so cold right now. <laughs> you know, I don't know. I'll figure that out. I guess uh, when New Year's Eve gets here, I'll pack one or two pretty dresses. And I'll pack a couple of pairs of pants and then I'll figure it out. By the time the night arrives, I'll know what mood I'm in, you know? <laughs> Actually, I'd love to wear her on New Year's Eve. I used to wear her when I did Gypsy Rose Lee, but, uh, <laughs> you know, she's beautiful. She still fits, but <laughs> I can't really dance in her. She's a strut-type dress, and uh, I definitely plan on getting in some dancing this year. Okay, so yeah, I still got to figure out what I want to wear for New Year's Eve. Part of it is the shoes, because I do plan on doing a lot of dancing to celebrate the end of 2015. It was a rough year for me. It was. But, um, <laughs> yeah, there you go. Hi. Um, but, you know, I, I, I can't let the fact that I'm sporting dentures when I go out to that bar prevent me from having a good time. You know, just because these aren't mine. I mean, when you think about it, by the time I finish paying these off, hopefully next month or February or something like that, technically they will be mine. <laughs> I mean, you know, the dentist can't come take them and the bank won't be able to come take them. <laughs> so they're mine. But no, really, truly, you know, a lot of people are sporting something fake out there. You know, some are sporting fake hair. Uh, you know, um, fake tits, <laughs> you know, sure, they're, I guess, prettier to look at than teeth, <laughs> fake butts, uh, you know, Botox wrestling, there's a lot of people out there that aren't presenting themselves 100%, <laughs> so I'm not going to let the fact that I am wearing fake teeth and, um, uh, you know, I got fake hips. <laughs> no, really, truly. Just because we're not 100% who we are when we go out to have a good time shouldn't prevent us from still having a good time, right? <laughs> so, yeah, New Year's Eve, the end of 2015. It was a rough year for me. I've earned a few beers. And I'm not going to focus on the fact that when I smile that these are not my teeth because they are my teeth technically because I paid a lot of money for them <laughs> but yeah I, you know I, it's nothing to be embarrassed by it's nothing to be ashamed of uh, you know I mean yeah I got fake teeth I'm a grandma oh well <laughs> okay so I'm heading to the party store to get some decor <laughs> you know for my hotel room Got to, got to make the room look festive on New Year's Eve, really, truly. But I don't drink and drive, and I definitely plan on doing some drinking. And, uh, well, <laughs> you know, got to decorate the room a little bit. I think that one's kind of cute. <laughs> These are cool. You can glue these to anything. <laughs> Alright. 
I got the balloon for my room. <laughs> That's right, 2016. Yeah, I'm gonna eat a cheeseburger. I met my goal <laughs> to eat a cheeseburger in public. <laughs> Hey, it's two days till New Year's Eve, <laughs> so I gotta go run some errands. But yeah, I did want to say that for those of you out there who like to shame people for wearing dentures, you're just silly. Okay, seriously, because there are a lot of people out there that have fake, you know, nails, hair, tits, <laughs> ass. Um, some of us even have fake hips and uh, there are a lot of people out there that have you know fake legs fake arms fake what my point is just because a person isn't 100 percent them doesn't really give you a reason to shame them there's, there's no reason to shame them seriously i just just accept the fact that you know some people have something on them that could be fake uh, running late to work, and I will say the biggest inconvenience to dentures that I have discovered so far is when I'm running late to work and, you know, the 15 minutes required to prep my dentures to wear to work, <laughs> you know, by cleaning them and getting the fresh cushion ready and the adhesive and drying this all off, it just, that 15 minutes, yeah. <laughs> it, it's hard when you're running late to work to deal with this. <laughs> yes, I'm packing my suitcase. <laughs> yes, tomorrow night is New Year's Eve. It's, you know, <laughs> at the end of the night now, my teeth are ready to be taken out. But uh, I definitely do need to still see the dentist after the first of the year. Because, you know, uh, when I smile, see, I don't like that. See, look, can you see that? <laughs> I don't like seeing that. <laughs> no. And granted, the glue's coming undone, so it maybe protrudes a little more. But even when they're glued in, when I smile, it still hits the top. And I don't like that. I just don't. And for as much money as these cost, I'm need to remedy this situation quickly. <laughs> but tomorrow night's New Year's Eve, and, uh, well, I'm just going to have a good time. Drink, glue them down just before I go out, and hopefully they'll make it through the night. <laughs> or should I say through the year? Right? Yeah, no. I am hoping after I glue them down tomorrow before I go have some beers, that when I walk back to the hotel room, they're still... Hanging in there. <laughs> okay, it's New Year's Eve, and uh, I'm packed and getting ready to head to the hotel. I glued down my teeth with just a little bit of fix it so I could at least talk to the front desk while I'm checking in. <laughs> but I'm not going to use that super glue cement stuff, uh, secure denture adhesive, until just before I'm ready to go out to the bar because, you know, <laughs> I, I want them to stay in my head while I'm dancing. <laughs> it's tough to decide between the dress or the pants, but you know, it's cold out, so I'm going to go with the pants. Yeah, super shiny or classic? I'm in super shiny mode. <laughs> I'm going to eat some cup of noodles before I go out drinking tonight. Okay, I've had my hot soup. I'm going to take a quick hot shower. And then I'm going to start getting ready for New Year's Eve. You know, um, <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen tonight other than I do plan on having at least a couple of beers, maybe even a shot. And uh, I'm definitely going to make sure... <laughs> These are glued down just in case <laughs> somebody tries to kiss me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm naked, yeah. <laughs> it's not even juicy. Anyway, I'm putting my mask on 
and uh, getting excited. It's almost time for a beer. What the heck? I'm going to put on some false eyelashes. <laughs> yeah, I'm going with a lot of fake tonight. <laughs> fake eyelashes, fake eyeliner, fake rhinestones, <laughs> fake teeth. <laughs> Yeah, coffee. <laughs> I wanted to go over my gums, <laughs> you know, without the denture in. And to give my mouth a little break before I glue them down for the next 10 hours. <laughs> Happy New Year's. Okay, it's 9.30. Time to glue these down. <laughs> okay, it's almost 10 p.m. And, uh, yeah, they're glued down. <laughs> and I'm um, hoping that if somebody does go to kiss me, that... I'll be secure in knowing they're going to stay in. But if not, well, <laughs> what can I do, you know? <laughs> I got my tear on, I got my dance boots on, got my teeth in. <laughs> I'm ready to go bring in 2016, and I definitely need a beer and some dancing. Good thing I brought a coat. It is cold out here tonight. got to end the night, not because my teeth fell out, but because my boots broke. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my God. And here I was worried about my teeth <laughs> falling out. <laughs> Instead, my favorite pair of boots broke. But the shoe doctor, he can fix that. <laughs> I've had the boots over 30 years, so you know, <laughs> I guess they were bound to break eventually. <laughs> But yeah, Happy New Year's 2016. No kiss, so I guess I didn't have to worry about what was going to happen in my mouth. <laughs> but my boots, my boots broke. <laughs> yeah, I think the shoe doctor can fix this. <laughs> I hope he can fix this. I love these boots. <laughs> So yeah, here I was worried about my teeth <laughs> falling out. Or if somebody tried to kiss me, you know, and I didn't even take into consideration my favorite boots could break. <laughs> but the shoe doctor can repair them, and I don't know if that's a, you know, a, a bad sign to the beginning of 2016, or a good sign since I didn't fall and break my ass while I was spinning when they busted to my favorite song at the time, um, yeah, Shut Up and Dance With Me, I love that song. <laughs> but yeah, I've had those boots for over 30 years, so they were due to break, but all this time I was worried about my teeth. <laughs> Shouldn't have been thinking about my teeth. <laughs> but, you know, maybe if somebody tried to kiss me, I might panic, so it's a good thing nobody tried to kiss me either. <laughs> Happy New Year's. <laughs>